Tuesday night, Mayor John Cranley addressed Cincinnati in his last state of the city. Tonight, the two men looking to replace him give their takes. And I agree with him. Uh, we have made a lot of progress in the la last eight years, and happily I've been a part of that. For the first time in decades, the city's population has grown. Uh, we have created in the last uh, eight years 29,000 additional jobs. There's no doubt that we have seen incredible progress over the last 20 years. Uh, but unfortunately, the, the challenges of gun violence, the eco economic downturn because of the pandemic, and then ob obviously the, um, the, the several indictments on city council uh, has unfortunately blemished some of that progress. On building back from pandemic-related economic hits, Pureval wants to take advantage of pandemic-influenced lifestyle changes, like remote work, to market the city to professionals. With equity in mind, Mann wants to support Cincinnati's neighborhoods and continue the rebirth of neighborhoods like Over the Rhine. Both candidates say addressing crime is a top-tier issue and that reducing poverty is part of that. Number one, we support our police, and we celebrate the fact that our police uh, have evolved so positively uh, in the last 20 years. We have to ask ourselves uh, why young people uh, ages 13, 14, 15 have illegal guns and uh, why are they apparently uh, lost souls without hope. No one of us has a magic wand to fix this issue overnight. But what I'm committed to doing is working with law enforcement, working with community stakeholders to get around the table and come up with the most innovative ideas that we can. And you can see that these candidates have a lot of the same uh, platforms and goals here. But Mann says he's also focused on restoring public trust. And Piraval says he's particularly focused on affordable housing. Reporting live tonight, Jatera McGee, WLWT News 5.